So there have been lots of debates in the security community about how to properly secure mobile devices. Some vendors have been running around left, right and centre for years saying that this is the year that all of the viruses move from the PC to mobile devices. And, well, frankly, every year nothing really happens. The net result is lots of disillusioned security practitioners, people saying that mobile devices don't really need to be secured in the same way as a PC. But 2011 showed us that the bad guys are actually interested in these devices. We started to see malicious code that targeted the Android and data breaches on the iPhone and Blackberry. Now so far, most of these attacks are actually pretty basic. They're a bit like 1990s PC viruses. But of course, the bad guys could start upping their efforts. There's no reason they can't produce attacks on mobile devices that are comparable to the PC. Now, in many ways, these devices actually might be better for cyber criminals, given they've got all kinds of new fancy features like GPS capabilities, location information, and often direct access to things like internet banking. But today, as I say, most of these attacks are quite basic. So it's not really about high-end clever products and super security systems. It's actually about doing the basics really, really well. Making sure that all of your mobile devices have got a password, they're using encryption, they're patched and up to date. Those basics are going to defeat most of the cyber attacks out there. But of course, over the next couple of years, as these attacks grow more comprehensive, we're going to need capabilities on mobile devices with parity to protection we had in the traditional PC environment.